What's up, motherfuckers? Cool Kid Collector here. Remember the 90s? Do you remember the 90s? I remember the 90s. I was born in 86, so I'm not a 90s baby, but I was a 90s kid. Do me a favor. I want you to close your eyes, and I want you to envision the 90s. All the cool shit that happened in the 90s. The things that you watched, the things that you played with, the clothes that you wore, whatever. Do this with me. Close your eyes. What? No, I meant it. Seriously, close your fucking eyes and, and envision the 90s. Let's do this together. Come on. Okay, we're done. Now, the BAM box. February's theme was the 90s. So I'm going to open this fucking thing. For the first time, I opened up this box before I did a video. And I'm... Really disappointed in it. I'm not gonna lie. So I'm just gonna fucking start off with the fucking. There was this poster. Whoops, my bad. It is Dr. Evil, Awesome Powers. It's like a fight bout from the old school. It's autographed by I don't fucking know who. To be honest, they actually wasted their time. And their paper making a certificate of authenticity for that autograph because nobody knows who the fuck he is. A beanie baby. A fucking beanie baby came in this box. Like, I got three giant fucking bins in my basement of beanie babies and they gave me a fucking beanie baby. Fuck you. I saw this box and I was like, oh shit, Boston Creative Company, it's all fancy and shit, like... Thinking it's like some, you know, some Franklin Mint. You know what I'm saying? But it's not. It's not. It's a fucking spoon. <sighs> Fuck you. It's a fucking spoon, dude. It says, no soup for you. No soup for you. How fucking retarded is that? I know it's from Seinfeld. There was like one episode and everybody really liked it and whatever. My jacket, I know you guys have seen my jacket before. I got all these badass fucking horror movie pins. At least like five of them came from the BAM box. And they're they're badass pins. I think the dude that makes their pins is from Florida and he makes kick-ass fucking pins. Just because like the content or whatever isn't cool, it's not that guy's fault. He's probably just doing what BAM box tells him to do. But this is a fucking pin. Furby. Fucking Furby, man. This is supposed to be like the big fucking hoorah. This is the this is probably like the coolest thing that well that what they thought was the coolest fucking thing. It's a hockey puck. Okay, cool. Remember the Mighty Ducks? Fuck yeah, you remember the Mighty Ducks? That was a badass movie franchise. There was like three of them, I think. I fucking love those movies. Here's a hockey puck autographed by Matt Doherty. This fucking guy. Like, the least memorable character in the whole fucking franchise. So, that's the fucking BAM box. Now, in the beginning, remember when I asked you to close your eyes and envision the 90s? Did anything that I pull out of this fucking box, did any of that shit pop in your head? Fuck no. You probably thought of, like, Saturday morning cartoons, Nickelodeon, Fresh Prince of Bel-Air, Saved by the Fucking Bell, Mighty Morphin fucking Power Rangers, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, like, the Sonic the Hedgehog, just, you know, like, there's so much fucking cool shit in the 90s that these assholes just totally fucking, no, they dropped the ball and I'm done with Bambox. I'm not gonna say they're complete shit because I've gotten some seriously badass things in the past from the Bambox. I mean, some of the stuff behind me is from the fucking BAM box. Uh, but yeah, man, the coolest thing in this box was the, the fucking black tissue paper that I'm going to fucking use to wrap all this shit up in and throw it in the fucking garbage. Unless any of you are interested in owning any of this shit, share the video, like it, comment, whatever. Make sure to use hashtag cool kid collector because that's the name that I go by when I do these little fucking boxes. And that's about it. So I'm, I, I think I'm done with the BAM box. This will probably be my last unboxing that you see of the BAM box. So to end on a positive note, I want to give a little quick shout out to a few people. 
to be happy, I guess. This fucking t-shirt. Look at this t-shirt. Oh my god, it is so fucking cool. Look at this thing. Look at it, look at it, look at it, look at it. The Massacre Machine. I got it from T-Villain. T-Villain.com. This thing is only like 16 bucks, dude. It was 13 bucks. Three dollars to ship it. Uh, another fucking random thing, because I always got to give these guys props, is Super Bob. I fucking love these guys. They're a band from D.C., so go ahead and get some Super Bob in your life. And check this out. Hold on a second. Dun, 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 dun. One more quick shout out. I want to give it to this girl named Vicky Sin. She makes really badass stuff. Check it out. Vicky Sin on Facebook. Vicky Sin Art also on Facebook. Look her up on Etsy. But this is one of the many things that I own by her. Okay, so check her out. I just wanted to end on like a positive note. I dropped her fucking business card. But I got one. Also, a uh, huge shout out to all my local 815 area bands. I'm not going to even begin to mention your names. Because if I miss one of you, that might piss you off. And I don't want to do that. just want to spread nothing but love. So, Cool Kid Collector, Darren Duncan, a.k.a. Joey Columbine. I'm back. I'm here. I just wanted to give a quick shout out and, and end this video on a positive note. Also... I did a contest uh, a couple day nights ago, and I didn't announce a winner, so I'm going to announce it right now. Kenzie Moore, you won that contest, and usually when people win contests, they give away things of my personal collection, and I know exactly what I want to mail to you, but I haven't found it yet. It's in a box, it's in my fucking garage, and I swear to you, as soon as I find it, I'm going to mail it to you, okay? Cool Kid Collector out. Remember, share, like, comment, whatever, but hashtag Cool Kid Collector. Okay? Is that okay with you? Can you fucking do that for me? Another thing we gotta end it on, a positive note, is tequila. I fucking love this tequila. Patron's great and everything. Joey Columbine, I don't know if you ever heard of him, but he's pretty cool. But this is amazing tequila. It's only like 15 bucks for a bottle. And it comes in a cork and everything. It's fucking fancy. Yeah, I use training wheels with my tequila, and I vape, whatever, fuck you, remember, hashtag cool kid collector, later brah.